And this is uh, now becoming more specifically into remedies that were specifically designed for brain chemistry disorders. And so this is my way of, uh, after 20 years of watching this in my patients, uh, using Dangui uh, Sunitang as a base remedy uh, to microcirculate the brain and then using herbs that are very brain specific, you know, using like the Shichangpu, the opening the orifice of the heart, and the ginkgo leaf, which is uh, acknowledged in all most cu cultures where their ginkgo trees are growing as something that has a direct affinity to the brain, um, improves brain circulation and memory, is a kind of blood mover from our perspective. And the uh, ji xue tang is uh, an herb that in modern TCM is a folk herb that's very good for anemia, like you cut it open, that's why it's called the chicken blood vine. Uh, it looks like it's bleeding, so it's an anti-anemia kind of herb, but it's particularly used for uh, problems, blood stasis problems in the extremities. So since Dangui Sunitang is sort of the mother remedy for all cases of chronic blood stasis, coming from blood cold, you know, that's really what Zhu Yin means. Blood stasis coming from blood cold. You can't just move the blood, you gotta warm the blood with cinnamon and dangue. And that effect then, to move to the extremities, particularly when people have Raynaud's syndrome or neuropathy, which a lot of uh, elderly people have, the Ji Xue Tang is for that. And the Mo Yao, the myrrh, is another modern Western from a modern Western perspective, the frankincense and myrrh are things that break through the blood-brain barrier. That's why I used it. The gotong is for uh, either high blood pressure or for wind, as in Parkinson's patient with a trembling, to bring that down. You know, so using the dangui sunitang overall warming and going up, and then using gotong, a large amount of that, to settle and counterbalance. So that even for this patient that I described to you earlier with the Parkinson's, still had a beet red face and high blood pressure, very high sometimes, that I wasn't afraid of using Dangui Sunyitang by balancing with Gotang. It's, it's like that person really has done well for over a decade. Uh, and I sincerely believe that that patient would not be alive without taking this remedy for longer periods of time. You know, um, the delong opening the collaterals, and then the astragalus part that then adds on the delong also adds that post-stroke remedy from Wang Qingren uh, called Buyang Huan Wu Tang from the Qing Dynasty. So this is also a post-stroke remedy uh, to kind of ensure that there is blood circulation uh, happening. Of course, you don't want to use huge amounts or so if they're already on Coumadin or so, but small amounts are good and you know so my mother-in-law she swears she's just taking one capsule twice a day of the evergreen pearls which is this called evergreen symbolizing the uh, staying young forever including in your brain uh, that greatly has been improving her mental clarity and you now this is a primarily an Alzheimer treatment Alzheimer prevention remedy but you can use it for anybody who manifests Julian syndromes of cold hands and feet and too low circulation in the brain, but also including when people have complications like shaking or wind symptoms or high blood pressure, don't be afraid to then outrule this kind of remedy. It's more complex. It takes a certain, you know, it took me 15 years to put this remedy together, but I'm very clinically pleased with that. You know, that uh, most degenerate patients are cold. You got to warm them. You can't cool them. Uh, and not be afraid of beet red, you know, and you, can't, you know, use Lundan Shigantang just because they have a beet red face. Uh, it's, they have a degenerative disease and you got to warm them rather than just purge the heat and the Vis Medicatrix Naturae, the power that heals out of the system, then you know better than a Western medicine physician, uh, allopathic physician using uh, tons of antibiotics and then wondering why the patient is getting weaker and weaker. So this is a good way of balancing, making a warming formula uh, safe for long-term use, even in situations of, uh, you know, uh, so, you know, the three capsules two times a day 
which is indicated on the bottle is sort of a good uh, preventative dose if you can use more if somebody is already in an Alzheimer or uh, Parkinson's or very degenerate type of state. But th this is a great remedy. For more information on this or other Prodi Live, distance or online courses, please visit www.prodiseminars.com.